Okay, I'm going to kind of round this up. I think we have enough evidence to show that this place is haunted. Diana, she walked in here and she picked up on a white man. Uh, wears a cowboy hat. Um, he could have been here when Loomis was founded, or he could be a more modern cowboy. Uh, English descent. Uh, he's always angry. He might have a habit of drinking liquor, and this place has liquor. Um, wears black jeans. And then we have uh, another entity, a black-haired woman. She wears modern type clothing or a gown from the 70s, well, sort of modern. Uh, she's always looking for something. She's got anxiety going on. <clears throat> she has black eyebrows. And she's sort of a healthy, thick type woman. Um, she also, too, envisioned the fact that she walks the streets barefooted. So maybe at some point in time she walked the streets barefooted. Um, maybe she lost a child. I don't know. She's looking for an object. Maybe it's a photograph. Maybe it's a photograph of that child. Um, it has sentimental value. Uh, we got three EVPs. Uh, one EVP we got it in the back room uh, where the man entity is, and it sounds like he says, I hurt. Uh, Deanna got an uh, EVP of a woman. The woman's voice is in the background. You can't make out what her words are, but it's definitely a woman. And woman, women sometimes do have very small voices because Deanna has a small voice. Okay, uh, Deanna also too got an EVP in the back room where the guy is, and she asked about, uh, does he know about the blood on the counter? And he distinctly says, yeah. So, so we did get three EVPs, and with the three EVPs, that's pretty solid evidence that there's something going on here. So, okay, you can close out.